Former NTUC Income Chief Executive Tang Kin Lien has said that the best outcome from deliberations by the Presidential Elections Committee PC is that either he or businessman George Go is found eligible to run for the presidency. This would make it easier to have discussions between the two camps to jointly support the candidate who is qualified to run, said Mr. Tang, 75. If both of us qualify, I still think it is a good idea that we should discuss who should step down. Because it's not good to have a split vote among those who want to have an independent president, he added. Mr. Tang was speaking to the media before he visited Jurong West 505 Market and Food Center on Tuesday. He had commenced his walkabouts after he launched his presidential bid last Friday with the theme, Bring Back Trust, Give Us Hope. On Monday, Mr. Go said he has no intention of bowing out of the race should he be granted a certificate of eligibility. This was in response to a suggestion Mr. Tan had earlier made to the media that the two men should decide who can step aside and support the other if the PEC deemed both eligible to run for the presidency. Mr. Go, 63, told reporters that he has not made any such arrangement with Mr. Tan. On Tuesday, Mr. Tan reiterated that a discussion with Mr. Go is needed, should both qualify to run. This is to decide who drops out of the race, in order to not split votes between themselves. It was a point he made again in the evening during a walkabout at the HDB hub in Toa Pale. Of course, Mr. George Go says he will not agree, but I hope he will change his mind, he said. I will certainly try my best to convince him. Mr. Tang said he had met Mr. Go a month ago, but would not say what they had discussed. We had a very good talk, so I think we should be able to talk again, he said. The best way to decide who, between them, should run would be to see who the people prefer. He added. Of course, it's quite hard to know who the people prefer, so this one has to be decided. And one possible way is to take a coin and toss heads or tails, he said. He acknowledged the possibility that he and Mr. Go could eventually both run. Even so, I don't think it would be an easy win for Mr. Thaman Shanmugaram, he said, adding that he has high respect for the former senior minister. My advisors and my team think that in a four-way contest, even the non-establishment candidate might win. In response to queries, Mr. Tang said he has not visited any civic organizations or community groups like the other presidential candidates have, as he did not want to put them in a bind. I have not approached these organizations because I think they are also in a difficult position. He said, if they agree to host one candidate, then they might have to agree on other candidates. He added, I think markets and MRT trains are wonderful places to meet people.